A lot of people have asked me my opinions on how I would fix D&D, especially Marshalls, and the answer is very simple. They need more options, they need AoE features, and they need to deal more damage. I've been saying this for a year now, but the design team and some people in the community don't want it. They want these classes and subclasses for Marshalls to be very easy for beginners. In some aspect, I do believe that is valid. However, my solution is different. I believe psychics should just be part of the base game, and they should label them with a tag that says beginner classes in the player handbook. These are just classes that are really simple, like the warrior class gets champion and brute as subclass options, for example. Spellcaster gets subclasses that boost cantrips and simple things like that, and so on. Then from there, boost the base psychics a little bit and make it very simple. If they boost it enough, maybe even some veterans will play them from time to time. Like if you join a table on the spot and don't have the time to make a character sheet proper, then you just roll up a quick beginner class instead. Now obviously if they do this, they have to rename psychics into something else, and I think beginner classes is just enough. This solution solves the beginner problem, then from there they can boost the base martial classes significantly, and give them the tag veteran classes, or just classic. I don't know. Anything really. This isn't even a bad thing to do, like it solves multiple problems, and it introduces three new classes to the game easily. It's not blouts or anything, these are just beginner classes, and it's not gonna introduce any power creep. Are you kidding me? This is easily more content, which is clearly something everyone wants. There is so much potential with these sidekicks. I'll show you what I mean, like people already have very good experience with this. Like this person here. They use psychics for a new player because they were too intimidated by the player character sheets looking too complex. And to be fair, the size of the rule books isn't really helping either. That's actually a very common thing for new players to feel. So how they got the new player to play was they made her a raven psychic, which is a brilliant idea. Then when she was comfortable enough, they rolled her a proper character sheet. The raven turned out to be a Kenku land druid in wild shape. This is just super fun storytelling. The raven happened to be a druid in hiding. Surprise! Now the reason why I've never shared this idea in a playtest video is because Crawford already shot this idea down. They're not even including Artificer in the book. They've abandoned Artificer. I've had this idea since playtest 1, but it's irrelevant to the playtest. They're not gonna do it. Anyways, conclusion. Use sidekicks. They're great, both as a DM and as a player. If you still have no idea what I'm talking about and you want to know more, check out this video where I actually cover the psychic rules properly. Anyways, end the video. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to support me on Patreon, you can. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.